fashion industry is one of the most major source of microplastic issues to our oceans. It comes from uh, one of the most frequently used materials in textile that is polyester. I am quite like, curious about what can I see and learn during this journey with the science team. The ocean and, and this expedition, it's about I don't know, it's a kind of like a relationship with this ship, with the sea, and with the scientist, and with the huge equipment, huge robot. I feel like this way, it's like the way the scientists cooperate with the robot, and I cooperate with the computer. Like you cooperate with the camera. What I do is to make the CTD to a creature. The creature, like, uh, I feel like it's have a spirit. Yeah, for me, it is really, like, really a precious opportunity to be here and witness what is truly happening under the sea. Uh, it is estimated 80% of the environmental impact of a garment is locked in the design stage because almost all of the like decision is made on that stage. So as a designer, I will be much more consciousness about what I'm going to use and what will that impact in the future and also consider the end of life management of the products. I heard about the artist at C program through Ocean Rising, a partnership between SOI and Necton, and um, I was excited about inspiring creative solutions to ocean issues. So I have conversation with the scientists, and they told me about their research. So I feel like I can feel the uh, scientific spirit from them. I think my role is to deepen public connection with the ocean's issue through so maybe a design or a garment so that it can heighten their consciousness and awareness of what is happening to the ocean and get involved in this ocean preservation movement. <laughs>